Hi there, today we're going to go through the 5.3 auto level system by Norco Industries and BAL Products. We're going to show you what to do if your auto level isn't set and how to reset that to zero again. One of the tools you'll need to set your auto level is going to be a level. Grab you one, uh, longer the better. You can get go ahead and set this in on your subfloor or through your pass-through storage area. We'll end up setting our auto level front to rear first, and then we will level the unit side to side. And from that point, then we'll go ahead and we'll hit our set button and we'll auto level the unit. Next, we'll go through the step-by-step -step procedures on how to um, accurately set your auto level. All right, your first step before you uh, attempt to get your auto level is go ahead and drop the rear internal foot pads on the leveling legs on both sides. Simply pull your cotter pin, drop your leg down as far as it'll go. You'll have your one, two, three, fourth hole. This is where you insert your cotter pin again, lock it in place. Do the same exact thing to the other side. And then from there, we'll go ahead and continue on at, up at the front tongue jack on the control panel. All right, first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna hold down on your battery icon in the lower left-hand corner, about three to five seconds, and then a touch pad will come up. You're gonna type in three, seven, five, nine, and that's gonna take you to your adjustment and set screen. From this point, you have your level sitting in your doorway or in your storage compartment. We want to do our front to rear first. We have extend, front. That's going to raise the front and retract, lower the front to a point where we're level. We're currently sitting in the level position front to rear. Now we need to extend top right hand corner, hit rear, once both rear legs, the foot pads are touching the ground, you can now manipulate the unit left to right level. Left will be your roadside, right will be your curbside or door side. Looks like we need to raise our right side a little bit in order to achieve a level. Once you've completed this and you've checked your bubble level and your level front to rear and left to right, go ahead and press your set button in the lower left hand corner and your auto level setup is complete. Once auto level set is complete, to ensure that that auto level took, you can run it through its cycle by going into the top right hand corner Manual mode, manual mode, extend front jack, and you can extend that up a few inches just to where it's not sitting level anymore. Go to your home screen, auto mode, auto level, hit OK, and let it go through its leveling process and double check your unit once it's completed and successful check it with your bubble level and just ensure that everything went right back to level where you had set it. System is currently going through and doing its auto leveling. Once complete, what you're looking for is a highlighted green bar that says auto level successful. Now that auto level is successful and complete, go ahead and check your bubble level just to ensure that it put it right back to where you had initially set auto level. And from here, your auto level's complete and you guys are good to go.